What is going on everybody? Volcom 123 here, back on Call of Duty Black Ops to bring you guys a much needed commentary. Uh, this is my first commentary in about, I have to say a month or three weeks, I don't know, uh, in between that time frame. But anyway, I'm going to talk about the game first and then talk about what I've been actually been doing for, these past, for this past month. So anyway, playing a quick game of Domination with my brand new M16. Uh, gold M16 that'll be and I'm using silencer and red dot but it's not really a dot it's a pink I don't really know what to call that shape but anyway uh, enough about that using pretty standard perk setup scavenger um, warlord just because of the two attachments and of course marathon that's pretty much I use but all I use but anyway um, what makes this gameplay unique is I was actually playing Search this uh, that uh, whole day that I got this gameplay, and I was using low kill streaks, and I decided to play one game of Domination, and just forgot to change it, and I was running three, four, five the whole time. The whole time. So anyway, about what I've been actually doing. Um, for two weeks or last a couple Fridays ago, um, I took a trip to Virginia Beach, Virginia, and uh, to meet and hang out with my old friends because I moved to Texas and our friendship or me being able to see those guys every day actually kind of faded away of course moving across the country so I just want to say thanks to you guys for um, especially Aiden I want to th say thanks to you for letting me stay in your house uh, for those for that week and a half or two weeks whatever I, I don't really know how long it was but anyway I want to th say thanks to you thanks to Joe um, EJ, Drew, JR, Jeremy, Zinjin, Kane, uh, who else? Brendan, if you guys are watching this, uh, thanks for hanging out with me because you guys were pretty much the only ones that came to actually see me uh, in this week time frame. I'm probably forgetting a couple people. I'm sorry about that. but So pretty much that's what we did. Uh, we pretty much hung out every day, swam, at, swam um, in a pool every day every single day um, there wasn't or not in a pool but uh, there wasn't one day in that two week period that we didn't swim so um, I did get sunburn well not sunburn because I'm a little bit too dark to get sunburn but I just got darker and I, I guess you can say I got sunburned because I'm peeling uh, my face and then and my arms so um, so yeah uh, let's see what else when I was with them uh, I was hanging out uh, you probably saw my vlogs I was hanging out with so you mad bro, so you mad bro, or Zinjin and Kane, uh, Aiden, Brent, or Aiden, Joe. We all went to Bush Gardens and had a pretty fun time there. Uh, I can't really, re really say much more about that because it was fun. Probably one, well, I mean the whole vacation fun was fun. I mean I can't say anything less about that because it was probably one of the funnest vacations I'd ever been on. And let's see, what else do we do? Uh, me, Zinjin, Richard, and Kane, one day we went crabbing, got about, I'd probably say 40 crabs, just, uh, we went into the bay, and got a string, got some chicken, some raw chicken, and threw it out, and I don't know, surprisingly, I thought it was gonna be harder than it actually was, but it was pretty easy, like, all we really had to do was get the string, get the chicken and throw out the string and probably about I don't know a minute a minute and a half later later there'd be a pretty much guarantee there'd be a crab on the chicken and you just had to take it out get it on the net and so yeah that that was probably uh, one of the funnest things too but I didn't really get to eat any because I had to go I had to uh, it was curfew and I didn't want to stay at Zinjin's house and make all, make all that, uh, or cook all the crab, because it would have taken long. I wouldn't have got back to Aiden's house till about midnight, probably around there. But let's see, that's that. And pretty much all we did the whole time was uh, hang out, just me, Aiden, usually EJ, usually Drew, um, usually Zinjin and Jeremy. And Kane didn't get there till the 21st. You know him as So You Mad Bra. But he didn't get there till the 21st because he also moved at the same, around the same time that I did. And he moved to Las Vegas. So that was uh, kind of depressing too. But anyway, right there. See my second 
second death. But also, uh, when I was there, we went to Ocean Breeze. It's a small water park. Road. Uh, three, I think it was, there was three new, three new water rides, and I got, to, had a chance to actually ride all of those, and it wasn't, it's not a really big water park, so it's not something that you can do all day, so we went at around, I think it was around 10, we went and ended up leaving at around 3, so it's not really an all day thing, it's just something that, something that you you go do for that little time just to be able to do everything and we did do a ride every ride so that was a fun a fun experience there I had never actually been there for surprisingly the two years that I did live there we uh, we um, actually got to ocean Bre ocean breeze so another thing that we did do was go to the beach we went to the beach the first time we went surfing. We woke up at eight in the morning, went out surfing because that's when the waves are best. And I'm not really the most experienced surfer, being away from it for that long. But for the most part, I I got to stand up on the board, got to ride a couple waves, stuff like that. And so we were from there from eight. The first time we went to the beach, we were there from eight till about eleven. It was me, Aiden, Brennan, and Jeremy, or Filipino boy as you know, uh, Jeremy. But that was when we went to the beach the first time. And after we went to the beach, we actually went to IHOP and had the unlimited pancake, uh, whatever you call it, unlimited pancake special. And we actually had unlimited pancakes. Sorry, I'm yawning. It's 3 in the morning. But I'm still getting this commentary out. It won't be uploaded until tomorrow, so you guys see it in the morning. But anyway, that was the first time we went. And the second time we went surfing, um, I don't know why we stayed out there so long. Um, it was probably just the waves, I guess. But we didn't really wake up that time. We didn't wake up till about 8.30. And we got to the beach about 9, 9.15, 9.30, around that time frame. But, yeah, we got there around, like I said, around 9.30. And we actually stayed there till 4 in the afternoon. So if you do the math, that's about seven hours of just being in the sun and most of the time we were, there was actually a period of time a three hour period of time where we were actually in the water actually trying to catch the waves because it's it's pretty difficult actually trying to to catch a wave like it I guess it's depending on how big your board is but still I mean it's it was pretty pretty frustrating not not being able to stand on the board and you can ask Aiden about that one he we were out there the whole time. He didn't even stand up once, and we were, we we're kind of joking and making fun of him because he couldn't stand up on it. And it was pretty funny, pretty entertaining, actually trying to, wa trying to see him, um, go, and go about that. But right here, you can see, C4 is always a good, uh, thing when you're playing domination because you just put it on the f the point or the flag point or next to it, and you double tap X when it says they're stealing it. And if they don't have flag jacket and you're lucky enough then you will get that kill. So, um, this the day this is going to be uploaded is Saturday uh, Saturday in the morning. And I'm not sure if I'm going out of town again. I might actually be going out of town on Monday. I'm sorry, guys. I'm not going to be able to get uh, commentaries out to you guys for probably until, like, the 25th, 24th, around there, uh, if I actually do go out of town again. But if not, then I'll still be here making commentaries for you guys. But right there, you can see I got the C4 kill because they were stealing it. And there we go. Final score, 37-3 with no high kill streaks. And next commentary will be what about, about what I did in Vegas, also part of my vacation. So anyway, guys, I'll see you guys later. Comment, rate, and subscribe. And thanks for watching.